Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to be trying to fit into my summer dresses. So of course with this whole quarantine that has been happening, people haven't been able to go to the gym and work out and get that summer body that we all been wanting. And in my case, that didn't happen and I also have a baby bump. <laughs> so it is about to be an adventure trying to fit myself into all of my summer dresses. I have picked out I think like six of them that I wore last year as well. So just to see the difference if I can still fit into them, squeeze into them. I highly doubt it, but this will be an adventure to see. So make sure you guys stick around, and before we get started, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button and notification bell so you know every time I upload. I upload twice a week on Mondays and Thursdays, so don't miss a video. And follow me on my Instagram to stay up to date with everything, and let's get started. So starting off with this first dress here, you guys have seen it in a Shein Tryon, Shein, Shein Tryon haul that I did with like a whole bunch of stuff that I bought for the summer. And when I did try that on, I was only sucking in like a little bit of fat. I, I could still pull it off, but now, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> Like, yeah, it looks cute. I can get myself into it. The only problem with it now is that it is extremely short. Like, I... Mm. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. The moment the wind hits this, the booty cheeks are coming out. And it's not going to be a good scene. It looks super cute from the front, but it's a mistake in the back. And... Mm. We're not gonna have that. So as excited as I was to be able to wear this dress this summer, I <sighs> know I'm not gonna be able to. So that's why I literally just took a picture in it on Instagram for my baby announcement pictures because there's no way this dress is gonna work for me <laughs> this summer. If it's the slightest bit windy, even if I have to like bend over to pick something up, it's just, no. Nope, it's not happening. It's not happening at all. So as comfy as this dress is, sadly, it's a no for this summer. So on to the next one. Let's see if everything else fits me. So this dress, I'm really just putting on for pure entertainment because no, I play myself myself with this this dress from Windsor I got a couple years ago I always loved this in the summertime just to be cute and a little sexy you know a little corset going on in the front but the back is zippered up and I think this dress is like an extra small so why try to get my six month belly into this I don't know honestly I just wanted to see I just wanted to see because you know it is very stretchy but it don't stretch that much. I was even struggling just to get it up past my hips and my thighs. And I was like, uh, yeah, this, this is not going to work. It's not going to work. So, um, this really is not going to work. There's no, there's no way. No possible way. Feeling like a big stuffed potato. I already know I look wild in this, so. Might as well just move on to the next because this ain't happening this summer. Mm-mm-mm. Nope. Okay, shout out to Pretty Little Thing for this one because this maxi dress fits. But also it is just a regular stretchy bodycon maxi dress. Like of course it's going to stretch and fit no matter what size I am. The only problem that because it is stretching a little bit more than what it did before, it is getting more sheer looking and kind of see-through so you can kind of see everything. But it is extremely comfy. So if there's a day that I just want to chill and not do anything, not have to struggle to put an outfit on or whatever, I'm gonna go with this one because it definitely fits perfectly. It's super stretchy, super comfy. We like that. We like comfort now. I definitely should have gotten this dress in other colors when I did get it a couple years ago, but you know, I can always just order some more. But seriously, I'm happy at least like this dress fits me and looks cute because the other two, uh, it was going, it was really going downhill for me and my dresses this summer. Besides the newer ones that I had bought that you guys saw in a previous try on haul that I specifically went up a size so that I could fit into them or bought maturity so that I could fit into it but at least this 
fits cute. It fits good. Oh my gosh, you guys, you don't understand how happy I am that this dress fits me this summer. I only got to wear it one time and that was in Puerto Rico in November. So I was really hoping that I was able to wear this dress this summer. <sighs> and I'm happy I can. The only down part, it's not gonna last me the entire summer because it is already kind of tight right here where like the seam is here. So uh, I gotta wear it sometime soon. But to be able to at least get the zipper up a bit, like all the way up, it feels so good to know that because I really love this dress. I got in, I had gotten it from Shein. I believe it's an extra small too, so. I'm so happy it fits perfectly. And it looks so cute. Oh, I am obsessed. I'm really obsessed. I'm really so happy. I was gonna be so mad. Like, so mad. If this did not fit me. So if anything, I will be wearing this like next week because that's probably the last time I'll be able to wear this. So hopefully next week has some good weather so I can go do something and look cute. In this dress you see this video is turning around we are going we are making progress we are finding dresses that still fit me in my closet I can't say that they're gonna still fit me by the end of August but you know what for right now for end of June beginning of July they fit that's what matters so this dress I knew it was going to fit me I had no doubts that it would I've had this dress for like five years it's been through a lot, but I knew it was gonna fit me just because it is big, flowy, all this room. Like you could probably be pregnant with like triplets and fit into this dress. But I still just wanted to show you guys some of the dresses that maybe I don't wear as often as well because, you know, you guys don't see as much of my full body outfits here on YouTube rather than Instagram, but you know, just wanted to show this dress as well. So, this one fits super cute with the belly, too. This one I'll probably be wearing for years to come as well. It's like that one dress that you just keep in your closet for years and years and years. And, like, it still looks cute. It doesn't go out of style. You can't really go wrong with a neon pink during the summertime. This one will be sticking around for a long time. Probably through baby bumps in the future as well. If I am pregnant in the summer, again, in the future but I love this dress honestly I love just like doing this with this dress and stuff and just being super girly and cute and it also you know neon makes you look even tanner even though I am fake tan but I am fake tan plus real tan outside it's just you know trying to be as tan as possible this summer so shout out to past me for buying stretchy dresses because luckily this one that I got from Windsor last year fits perfectly also because it is super stretchy it's going to hug you in all the right spots it did last year and honestly I think last year there was even like a little bit of room in my stomach so now it just fits all cute and perfect and I'm happy with how it looks so thankfully this video wasn't that much of a fail and all these dresses fit me with the exception of Two of them that was either too short or too tight and does not fit, cannot zipper up. I'm just going to try to stay away from zippers because that's when things go wrong and they don't zip up and hold you in tight. So just go with the bodycon because they're going to stretch and they're going to fit perfectly but this is really like one of my favorite dresses in the summer too so i'm so happy that i can wear it for another summer and make it look cute so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you all enjoyed be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it also you made it to the end of the video you might as well just subscribe if you aren't already and i will see you all next time